from Parker Rink. It's Hockey Day. It's Senior Day here on the Candace Way. Bernie Corbett, Mark Linehan. Glad he could join us at Boston University Terriers and the Vermont Catamounts. Lane those right back. Shovels it to Celebrini. Far circle. Clint oh. Hudson and a goal off a pretty feed. The Terriers a little tic-tac-toe. Great recovery by Lane Hudson after he got picked. Terriers now get it back offensively. Green brings Case McCarthy down. Case to the front and deflected away. Quinn Hudson, far circle, Rister and a goal, Quinn Hudson. Good lead there on the stretch. Up over the line in front, oh, they had Sabinet for the bang, bang finish. Kaplan and Wilmer worked it nicely. Now right back, Miotto, coming down central. Drops it right side, shot in, that just grazed wide of Karan. Polinski uh, came right back in, sprawling, oh, saved by yeah. Karan, and he'll hang on wow. for a faceoff <laughs> deep in the BU zone. Yalski, opposite back. Yelush with a wrister and a goal. Yelush used the screen in front effectively. And the Catamounts are on the board. And he's in, though. Green has Zabonet. Zabonet down low. Zabonet now fights away from one man. One man gang here. Now he's going to send Green trailing for Zabonet. Zabonet, ah. wrister and a goal. Nick Zabonet. His third short-handed goal of the season. Oh, back now Celebrini. Deals it off with Chance, back to Green, sprawling, saved there. Mangbo with Ryan Green. Wilner walks down to the near circle, gives it up to Celebrini, in front of the goal! Celebrini wrists it home, glove side, with 7.09 left, that is number 29. On Walking the line, pulls it down low, shifts away, loses Richards. Centered it, but it hit a skate. Terriers now, it turns over to Harvey. Harvey in front! Oh, hit. and a goal, Harvey. Beat him shorts on the backhand. Yep. On the backhand, nifty move to the backhand for Jack Harvey. Over the line, Stevens races in, try to drop the tuck. Quinn Hudson, Zabonet. Zabonet says Quinn needs one. Quinn and a goal! <laughs> Quinn Hudson! <laughs> Catamounts have it, and the Terriers will skate away. The Terriers of Boston University will finish the regular season with a flourish here this afternoon with a resounding 6-1 to victory over the Vermont Catamounts. Four power play goals tonight, shorthanded one. Just what do you think of special teams? Yeah, I thought it was uh, really good. Um, it's great when you score uh, on your first two power plays. I think it gives the group confidence. Um, shorthand was good. I think we gave up one, but, you know, killing off, a, you know, most of the five-minute major was good for our group. Um, so, overall, good effort, uh, good way to finish the uh, regular season. And Quinn Hattrick and hits 30 points this season. Just how have you seen him develop in the second year? Uh, he's uh, continues to get better in all areas. Um, he's gotten better defensively this year. Um, we know we can finish. I think, he, you know, I don't know what he's en ended up with, uh, with sport 15 maybe right now. Um, he could easily have over 20. Like he's uh, been a little bit snake bitten at times. Um, hopefully he's getting hot at the right time. Um, but he, he always scores big goals for us. Um, so he's been great. Yeah, I thought in the third, um, again, we, for the most part, started a little slow, but we started getting our chances, and we finished off a few more plays and extended the lead, and that's what we're trying to do in third periods when you have the lead. So overall, good effort. Henry Graham and Nick Howard get some time there. Just what have they meant to the program, even if they're not playing this season? They've been great um, all year long. Uh, they, you know, they, they, they do extra. Um, they mean a lot to our team. They're, they're great in the room, so our guys have a lot of respect for them. So really happy to, to get those guys a chance to get in the lineup. Nick Zabonet with his third short-handed goal. Just what can you say about his individual compete level, even without having Peterson and Wilmer? Yeah, he never stops competing. I don't, I don't think it matters who he's playing with. He's, he's going to play the same way. Uh, so great to see him get rewarded again. Uh, with his speed, uh, he, he's dangerous short-handed, and we've seen that this year from him, so great for him. I do. I, I think um, he's going to practice this week, and we'll, like I said, it'll be day to day. But we still have time here, so we got a week uh, for him to get into practice, get back into uh, game shape, and we'll go from there. I guess what's the focus in practice this week? No school, so. Yes, yeah, so we have a lot of time to focus on practice and not school, so that's the one thing. Um, I think it'll be similar to our, our typical practice week. Uh, we'll probably go two days on since we don't definitely know we're not playing until Saturday. We'll probably be two on, probably have Wednesday off, and then practice two days leading into to Saturday. 
it'll be our typical practice week. We won't know who we're playing yet, so you know the, it'll be a little bit different game prepping. But we're we're uh, more focused on how we're going to play. Just the call on Wilmer, famous conduct. Did you guys have an opinion on that? Um, they're going to call hits to the head. Uh, I didn't. I haven't looked at it closely. I have to look at it again. Um, but. I'm sure they saw something. They they wouldn't uh, you know gave him that penalty otherwise. Just what are you most looking forward to starting the playoffs? Um, I'm looking forward to hopefully our team playing the way we're capable of playing. And I think the last two weeks or three weeks, I know we had the bye week. Uh, I think we were going into the playoffs playing pretty well. Uh, it seems like we have all our lines going. We have all our D going. So uh, that's a good recipe going into the playoffs. You're up uh, four goals less less than two minutes. Macklin still driving to the net, drawing penalties. Is, is that what you're accustomed to seeing from him, no matter what the situation is? He's going all out. He, he doesn't stop. That's how he is in practice every day. That's just how he's wired. He, he competes to the very end. Uh, we, were, we were down to 10 forwards with uh, when Wilmer left the game, so everyone you know got plenty of ice time there. And Yeah, our, our guys, they typically aren't going to stop competing, and, and that's what you saw there at the end with him. Thank you. Um, third short handed goal of the season for you tonight. Just what makes you so effective on the penalty kill? Um, I think it's like a four man unit out there. It's not just uh, it's not just me. I mean, like on that goal, Greener made even Gav like sending it out, uh, putting it on our tape. And then Greener made like two unreal plays to me. So I mean, it's just kind of like reading off uh, reading off like the three other guys on the ice and. Um, I think there's like a little more room out there, I guess. We only have four out there, so I could use my speed a bit more as well. Yeah, I mean, it was pretty cool. It comes by fast. I mean, I remember like the past three years, senior night, like all the classes above me, and it's crazy that like, uh, like now I'm, uh, now it's like my night. So, uh, yeah, a little emotional, just kind of the last regular season game at Aganis for me. Um, you know, I was really happy my parents and my brother made it out. Uh, it means a lot. And, you know, uh, fortunate to uh, have played for BU the past four years, that's for sure. Did it give your class kind of more drive going to this postseason? Not that it's not always there, but just that it's Yeah, I mean, um, you know, I think just kind of building off like the last three years, um, you know, freshman and sophomore year, uh, two disappointing kind of like postseason uh, results and then obviously last year um, making it all the way to the Frozen Four. So uh, I think just kind of the last kick at the can, uh, it means a lot for our class and, um, you know, we're really dialed in right now and, um, you know, we're playing good hockey and uh, I think that's what matters. So, um, you know, we're going to start gearing up on Monday and get ready for the quarters next Saturday. How important was it to close out the regular season with such a dominant yeah, it means a lot. I mean, they kind of ha held in there for, uh, you know, two periods there. They played hard. Um, and, you know, I think it's just sticking with it, playing the full 60 minutes. Uh, I think we are struggling with that as of late. So, I mean, just kind of coming out in the third and, um, you know, doing, uh, you know, doing our thing. Um, you know, I think that means a lot, especially heading into playoffs. Yeah, I mean, they're my... Uh, you know, they're my brothers on and off the ice. So, you know, to see them uh, get in, um, you know, everyone has different opportunities on this team and different roles. But to see, you know, like someone like Ajar, um, you know, who I'm really close with off the ice, uh, to see him like get in the game and also Grammar and Howie, uh, just guys like that. Um, you know, and also like we're in the same class. So, uh, you know, I hang out with them a ton off the ice and it just means a lot, uh, you know, for me, the team and also for them to kind of get in there and uh, contribute. Yeah, it's nice. I mean, it's more downtime. Uh, you can spend more time like at the rink, whether it's working on skills, kind of in the gym, or uh, just watching video. Um, you know, and even like away from the rink, just kind of spending time with the team. Um, you know, it's uh, it's a really fun time of the year. Um, you know, it's kind of like again, no classes, which is nice. Uh, so I mean, yeah, it's really fun and. Uh, I think we're going to take this week um, with all the downtime to kind of, you know, gear up and make sure we're in the best possible shape for Saturday. Thank you. Thank you.
yeah, it's uh, got stronger, so it's a little bit easier out there and playing with more confidence, so I think that helps a lot. Where does that confidence come from? Just experience, playing a bunch of games and playing with all these guys every day and a lot of practice and a lot of games helps a lot. No, I, I, don't, I won't get old ever. It's pretty cool every time. And just the power play tonight, four power play goals, what was working, especially under anything? Uh, I think we just got a lot of shots in the net, so we, I think we've been passing up a couple shots and, or haven't been hitting the net, so they're all hitting it today, so it helped a lot. And then senior night, is, what has the senior class meant to you? It's meant a lot. They, there's all, there a lot. Last year, there's a lot of them guys that stayed. We had a lot this year, so they're good leaders for us, and they do a lot for us, so it helps a lot. How important was it for the team to put together a dominant performance ahead? Oh, we're rolling in a playoffs now with a lot of confidence like that. We know what we, we can do, so I think it'll help a lot. Awesome. Thank you.